right. Let's go. Uh, okay. So let's see here. They I are... do not know why my connection is this bad. I I don't it, know. It, I am like looking at the stream and it's like it it I should be fine right now. Everything on my side is fine. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. should it, it should be good. Um, Probably uh, not you. Abria, if you're watching, feel free to jump in now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think she was watching, so I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do that. Um, so, uh, yeah, let's see. That gives, that gets everybody in there, I believe. Okay. Um, nope, we're still missing people. Why are you all hidden? There we go. Okay. Working on it. <laughs> all right. So first up is a white... Uh, and this white is close to Palando. Now, I will say, before Can we, we roll, how, 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 how does initiative work? So, oh, I see. Yeah. Ooh. So uh, it's the little fist icon in, in the in the upper right. Uh, and um, initiative in Savage Worlds is done by drawing from a deck of cards. And uh, ace is high, two is low. And then uh, it's by suit order after that uh, in reverse suit order. So uh, let's see. Um Spades are first, then hearts, then diamonds, then clubs. So um, first up is the white who has an ace of diamonds. And jokers are wild, by the way. Jokers can be in play. And we um, see uh, the order. Yeah. If you click on if you click on that fist, you should be able to see the order. Sorry, which fist? Uh, in the, the upper right, right where the chat. Oh, icon gotcha. Is, yeah. gotcha. Ooh, uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's yeah. cool. Yeah. E sports. <laughs> So, um, this, this, uh, this white is going to come to Palando. Now I'm going to say this, um, just really quick that, uh, uh, combat in Savage Worlds is not a, um, hit them until they're dead type of thing. You can do that. And, and honestly, for like Glorfindel and Bundesh, that's, that's a big component of what you do. However, you can test, uh, other, uh, or other, other characters and, and people that you're you're fighting um, by uh, you just tell me what you want to do. Like if you want to intimidate them, if you want to taunt them, if you want to uh, do a fighting test, like you want to faint to one side or another or something like that, you can try and do that. And all of that can uh, may not hurt the uh, opponent, but it might put them at disadvantage when it comes to their role. Um, so there's a lot of things you can do without just like I club them over the head with my staff or I shoot bolt, you know, for the 14th time or something like that. Um, however, that's uh, that's that's what we've got now. Uh, I think that it rolled you all. Yeah, it gave you all what you needed to do. Uh, so Sauron, the one thing that you need to know is that if you get a um, yeah, if I get if I if I had a five or a lower, I yes. could do some things cool, but I didn't, so I don't right. think I can. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I, I yep. Thank you. I, cool. I was I did some reading. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank yeah, you. I did not I did not have an action card of five or less for my thing. That would be cool. But oh well. Uh that that's awesome. Oh, Drac, are you on that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, cool. Thank you. Um yeah, so uh, uh, this white is going to um, attack you, um, Palando. Come on. I said this white is going to attack you, Palando. Why is the white attacking? Good luck. <laughs> Abria. Who's that? Hi. Holy. Hi. I don't, I don't know her. Who is she? There we go. Nice. <laughs> Yay. Alatar's here. Hi. I should have been very quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Late from heaven. Sorry. <laughs> um, all right. So uh, just, just do your thing. Just attack, you stupid. Oh, that's why. 
Oh, yeah. Ow. Oh. OK, that's a 15. <laughs> uh, what's your parry? Uh, five. Cool. So that's a success with a raise with a raise. So you would take a you would be you're shaken. Uh, so Mark shaken and then uh, you will take two wounds unless you would like to soak them. Uh, yeah, I think I'll soak those with bennies, correct? Yes. Yeah, so spend a benny and then give me a vigor roll. Uh, that's this one. Sorry, oh, yeah. just watches it happen and goes, oh, no. Oh. Do you want to you want to reroll that? <laughs> oh no! Yeah. Don't do uh, it. No, you know what? I'll take that. I'll take it. Okay. All right. So you have two wounds. Ow. Um, and uh, just just so, so everyone knows, like everyone from from the lowliest peon to the to Sauron himself has three hit points. Yeah. Um, all right. Okay, next up is another white. Oh, these whites. Oh. These damn whites. <laughs> these damn whites. <laughs> these white. I agree. I head. also hate these whites. <laughs> <laughs> An ally. We love it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> ally. <laughs> ally. <laughs> That is the new threshold for allies. Right? Yes. Yes. And I love that. <laughs> oh, that was that. Okay. Sorry. Uh, okay. Let me just redo this. There is not that white there. That white is there. Okay. There we go. Uh, okay. Next up, actually, that I eliminated that white because it was in a weird place. Uh, Sauron, you are up. Okay. Uh, I feel like he's gonna get right to it. Um, because looking at this area, look at these people, these things, these audacities attempting to touch my hair and try my patience. Um, looking at Palando and how they just absolutely struggled at the house down boots. Um, there's a level of just anybody who watches can see a hint of disgust on his face, but it quickly becomes a smile. As he looks over at this white uh, and he says, these may be your lands, but I was here before you were even born. Allow me to show you. Uh, and as he says the word you, uh, he kind of steps his um, staff on the ground once. And that you kind of echoes in this white's mind. As I'm going to attempt to mind control it. Nice. Okay. Um, I use yeah. five of my PPs to do it. Yeah, but we'll see. Yeah. We'll see uh, okay. So, um, give me a spell casting roll. Uh, is a spell? Okay, I'll take. I thought it was intimidation. No, because you're trying to mind control, right? Yes. Okay. No, listen. I'm. A, I'm gonna listen to you. I'm listening to you. Spellcasting is higher. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, so, so here's so so here's the thing. So you you kind of have to do two things when you cast spells. Um, you have to make sure that you are capable of casting the spell, which you are. Mm -hmm. um, uh, you just got a five, so you're able to do that. Uh, now um, you're trying to are, you're are you trying to mind control or you're trying to intimidate? I'm trying to mind control it. Yeah. So it's under my control. So, so, uh, that's a success. Um, let me see. It's going to get a spirit roll to try to, uh, uh, I believe, let me just double check mind control here. Uh, yeah. If the controller fails, the, okay, blah, blah, blah. Okay. I, I get to make a spirit roll at a minus. Nope. Not a minus. Cause you didn't get a raise on it. So I get to make a spirit roll here. Yes, if I had a raise, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Minus two. That's a six. Uh, and you got a five. So they actually beat you. Do you uh now that you know that, do you want to re-roll? I should I should make you I should ask you before I give you the opposing roll. However, I will give you the opportunity to re-roll if you want. I'm gonna I'm gonna re-roll that. Is that a okay. using the Benny, right? Spin to Benny, yep. 
And remember, everyone in chat, if you sub to the Kofi, 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 I don't know how you pronounce it. Uh, you can give us another Benny. Um, <laughs> no one so knows. I'm the only one that has no idea how to pronounce <laughs> I it. I don't think they I know. Change it every time. I, Fair. I, yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, beat that. Beat Holy 17. Holy crap. Yes, yeah, so awesome. Ooh. So, yeah, no, he, he can't beat that, obviously, uh, with a six. So that's a success with a raise. Uh, with a raise. With a raise. No, that would be what, what, eighteen. Wait, what? what 18. Uh, oh, sorry, six, eight. Yeah, I, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's almost six, six. Then four plus that. Then four plus that. So that's a sixteen. Would be a raise. Sixteen. Two raises. Yeah. So that's a success with two raises. So yeah, a um, hundred percent. Um, so uh, you are you basically are able to um, command this creature. Um, and I'll just smile and you all don't see me saying anything after I've done this echo, but in their mind, they say, destroy your brethren. That is your price. Nice. That's me. Okay. Very cool. <laughs> uh, Glorfindel. Ah, I've been itching for a nice warm-up bout before I chop Sauron's head off myself with my blade. Uh, I take out one of the arrows in my quiver, I string it along this, uh, longbow, which as I take it out, we all see it's, like, super ornate, engraved, it's, like, thrumming with magic, it's, like, a masterwork weapon. Um, it definitely has a name. And actually, like, a, <laughs> I think as Gorbidil strings the arrow, they even say, ah, Belthronding. <laughs> That's the name of my foe. Uh, yeah. Belthronding, my good friend. Let's hear you sing and whistle through the air once more. Let's see. How about you? And I'm going to train my gaze on... Why not this guy? Okay. The one up top here. I don't know if you can see sure. my cursor. Yeah. And try to shoot that thing. Great. So give me a shooting roll. I, I, okay. just have to, I just have to say, as they say, you know, oh, when my blade can hit Sauron themselves, I just think Sar Sar Saruman just looked and it's not audible, but he gets, didn't you die to a ball rock? <laughs> <laughs> I have enhanced Ouch. hearing. So if I'm trying to hear something, I hear yeah. it. Uh, totally. <laughs> Fine. He probably, I mean, he probably, that. well, he probably sighs, but it, it was it'd be on, on the, on the uh, side of, you lost two of my R and you expect to kill another one. Interesting. <laughs> well, listen, everyone gets second chances and this is my glorious one. Uh, I'm going to call a headshot right here. Uh, I'm gonna fly. Do you want to call a headshot? Yeah. Uh, one okay. of my hindrances is that I'm overconfident. So absolutely. 100%. <laughs> so, okay. A called shot to the head is a, a minus four on your roll. Jesus. So, <laughs> so it's, it's, a, it's it. Yeah. It's a, it's your shooting and then minus four. So you just roll your shooting. Okay. We'll, we'll do the math. I have a multi-action penalty that I can impose also, or should I do a none? I'll just do none and we'll do a minus four uh, when it's done. Yeah. Unless uh, are you wanting to do another thing after you fire the arrow? want this to hit so probably not i'm gonna focus on this this shot fair enough let's do it okay that's a nine minus four is a five which is a success that hits nice baby so this arrow flies and it goes right into the head of this barrel white and uh just a scream of oh wrong one there we go. <laughs> Damn, you got that high note. And that it was dies. beautiful. That, yeah. That's <laughs> it, it dies, it straight up dies? It dies. Oh, that's whoa. That's amazing. <laughs> listen, listen. And I think I, I even like uh, do like a bow in front of Saruman. And that's the opening act. It, uh, actually, yeah. I'm going to say it dies, but what I forgot to do is have you roll damage. Um, <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so just roll damage for me just to say that we did it to appease people who are coming back and watching this and going, wait, what the hell? You didn't roll damage. Hey, hey people in the future, you yeah. got to get out of the comments. Don't worry about it. It's yeah. fine. <laughs> uh, so that's a total I think of... I I rolled the right damage. Yeah, that's that's a total of four. Um, uh, but Ooh, the, the... Actually, I think I... 
I have one more d6 I need to roll. It's a 3d6 plus one. Uh, and I only rolled 2d6. Three, oh. uh, no, I think it, oh, it's 3d6. Yeah, 3d6 plus one. Yes. Uh -huh. How do I do that? <laughs> uh, can I just roll like a regular d6 and just add that to the roll? Sure. Okay, I'm going to just hit spirit, which is a d6 for myself, but that's not what we're doing here. Okay. Just one of, we can take the lower one. It's fine. Okay, so that's so that would be a five total then. Um, and then I, I will Plus say one. So I a six. So that's a six. Yes. Do you want to reroll that? Uh, yes, but I would love to roll it correctly. Uh, what I have in my gear in the in the VTT, uh, mm -hmm. the bow is a 2d6. Um, but what I have on my character sheet that was sent to me, it's a 3d6 plus one. But I don't see mm. a place to click and roll that anywhere. Is there a place to manually roll something? Like, can I put roll 3d6 plus one? Yes, like if, you, if you put slash okay. roll and then 3d6 cool. plus one, it will do it. I'll do that. And I'll, I'll spend a Benny to reroll. Um, Benny in a diff. <laughs> Uh, so that's a that's a ten. You Is feel that good? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't do you know want to reroll that, or, or if you feel good about having a ten? That sounds good. A ten feels pretty good to me. Yeah, I'll keep that. Yeah. A ten feels feels pretty good. All right. Um, uh, because I said you killed it, I'm going to give it to you. Just just because of the awesomeness, because you scored basically a headshot on this thing, it immediately yeah. dissipated. Um, but a 10 is not what you needed. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. <laughs> um, uh, all right. Next up is this white up here who is going to move. Oh, there's more whites than I thought. I was zoomed in. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to giggle about this every time. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I did this? Whoa, <laughs> damn, there's so many whites. Every time uh, we walk in here, we get surrounded by whites. By white. yeah. <laughs> They're all trying to touch someone's hair. Like we've even... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, um, this white uh, uh, comes uh, up to oh, you, Glorfindel, and um, is going to attack you. Let's see if they can. Oh, there's my PP. Oh, yay. Oh, my PP got used. Yay. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> my PP got used. That's a <laughs> phrase I wasn't thinking I would hear this morning. Um, all right. Um, <laughs> so uh, 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 that's a five. What is your toughness, Glorfindel? Toughness? Of yeah. Where is it trying to hit me? Um, it's, it's, it's just at your torso, basically. So I do get my torso bonus. Uh, so yes. that's an 11. Nice. Yeah. So, so it, it slashes with its claws, but it does not find purchase on you at all. Uh, it just kind of glances <laughs> off your armor. I am a little higher next time. Go for the head. Very nice. Uh, all right. Next up is the next white. All these whites. <laughs> All right. And this one is going to go after you as well, Glorfindel. Um, I made you all like impossible to hit. Uh, <laughs> that's my fault. Not all of us. My Not bad. all yeah, of us. I know. I know. Yeah. Yeah. He just has to go after <laughs> the wizards. All right. I um, have plot armor. Sorry. <laughs> you can always be re embodied, that's wizard. <laughs> Uh, that's Set a three. Like a threat. Yeah, that's a miss. Uh, all right, Bundush, you're up next. Um, Bundush is grinning from ear to ear as these things re jump out, and he's just like, "I'm gonna have to get paid for this labor. I think some of those gems inside that grave is fair game." And he's gonna just run at, um, I think the one, one right next to me, one that's just a match to attack Glorfindel. Okay. Um, and I want to slam into it with my masterwork axe. Is that jumbo leg? Jumbo leg? Yes. Um, <laughs> jumbo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and that's a fighting roll, right? That is a fighting roll. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
I'm good at that. I actually regret saying that because I might have, okay, I barely made it. Um, <laughs> so uh, that's a five, which does not hit. Oh, okay. I mean, in that case, I think you see um, him jump at this. Um, oh, okay. I'm understanding. So like some things that I have like a set, like four as the set. minimum, and the other things are. So your parry and your toughness are the two special target numbers um, that if you're in melee combat, you're trying to beat their parry. Um, if you're in ranged combat, uh, you just need a four. Um, gotcha. And then to do damage, you have to beat meet or beat their toughness. So, gotcha. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. I was, mm-hmm. I was trying to figure that out. Yeah. I'm going to use a Benny. Like, I, I mean, I have, I have three. Go for it. Yeah. One. Don't forget, really folks, well. you can send Bennies to your favorite players. Just sub up on coffee or Ko-Fi or Ko-Fi. Ko- I know. Is that, that any better? Six. Coffee. <laughs> Ko-Fi. Uh, uh, that is also a miss. Damn. So, yeah, I think you just see um, him. I think what I'm going to go, he's still like kind of staring past the white at the the mound that he knew that there were like gems and jewelry buried there. He's kind of distracted. He's like, wait, just hoping for this fight to be over so he can start digging. And he <laughs> yeah. absolutely misses this white. And you see this um, blade of the um, axe slam into the ground. You see the ground crack underneath the the sheer weight and force that he slammed it down with and just goes oh god damn it and wrenches it out and gets ready to attack again in his yeah. next turn yeah nice yeah and um honestly give me a spirit roll oh okay <laughs> five great so yeah you are still able to tamper down this feeling this need this desire to go into these barrows and and you're kind of feeling like these barrel whites are preventing you from doing this and they don't want you to have this uh loot basically um and that's not nice not nice at all listen you use their life i'll <laughs> pick it to, to good you <laughs> okay alatar Cool. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Alatar is very brave. And if you see her uh, looking like she's sort of crawling across Palando out of nerves and uh, frustration, that's uh, it's a special fighting art we've been working on for a while. Uh, but I am going to try to crawl around him and then cast a bolt from behind him on uh Who's our who's our most injured looking white? This uh, feels bad to say. Uh, the one. Um, uh, you, they all look the same. OK, yeah. perfect. Um, then I'm going to just aim for the one on the right. That's sort of nearest to me. Uh, this guy. Yeah. Yeah. Let's okay. let's let's hit him. OK. Great. Uh, and you're trying to do a you're firing a bolt. I'm firing a bolt with my spell casting. Great. Perfect. Um, make it so. Sweet. Uh, problem. I yeah. double click my character and I can't get the sheet to pop up. So I could just do slash uh, for dice rolling. Yeah. Um, uh, this is a little bit more complicated because you oh, no. uh, have a wild die that you need to. Oh, it works. Use. Never mind. Oh, great. OK. Well, I having a whole day it's great this is yes we're having a whole day and thank you rules rules narcs uh i appreciate rules narcs um when it comes when i'm gming because i appreciate it i really do um all right you got an eight that is a success with a raise uh uh so roll your damage for that bolt Um, and on your character sheet if you if you uh are looking at your character sheet under quick access you should yes. see bolt. And if you click the text bolt, it will open up a sub menu below it. And you just can click that damage roll. Yeah. Button. Should I click with roll raise or no? Uh, yes, with raise. You said it and then I didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, you 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 got uh, you got two sixes uh, and uh, Jesus. Hi, I four. <laughs> So, um, 
Uh, roll, just give me one more d6. Alatar's like, oh, I'm here. Just blow someone up. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you just rock up late and mm -hmm. it seems, oh God, how do I just roll a six? Just a type slash roll. Uh, I was just, here when we did that before. Why am I doing this? I was here when it was first written. <laughs> <laughs> Do not recite the black speech to me. Black? Oh, no. Why is it got to be black? Um, God. That was an that, extra one. And I that don't know is a college level course amount. right there. Um, <laughs> the amount of time it took me to roll that doesn't feel like it was worth it. I got yeah. <laughs> that is a 16. That is enough to take this barrel white down, though. Very good. Very well done. So, yes, your bolt mm -hmm. goes and explodes into its chest cavity and just erupts into this blue flame and then it's gone. Ah, what are we doing? Why are we killing things? Palatar. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You, you mean Palando, not Palatar? <laughs> Oh, sorry. Yeah, it, it's, 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 it's in there as well. I know. <laughs> That's so weird. Uh, yes, uh, uh, Palando. I <laughs> shall roll spirit in order to uh, well, actually. So, uh, a quick question before you do that. Um, I need to know this, but I need to know if they are counteracted to each other, and I need to know if they're just things that happen. Uh, I have a thing, an ability, which is command that uh, extras a wild card to us or them, whoever, within 10 yards of me get to add the plus one to the spirit of Vigoros when they're attempting to recover from being shaken or stunned. Is that an active action to take, or is that just something that happens? That's just something that happens. Okay, great. Second part to that. I also suffer a negative four if I try to help somebody. So is that going to happen? No, that's only on a support role. Gotcha. That's a very you specific are thing. Not a team yeah. player. I am yeah. not. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> you don't know that yet. <laughs> Interesting. So I am shaken. I can roll spirit to get rid of it. If I spend a Benny, do I still get an action? If you spend, yes. Uh, you can still act if you unshake. If you okay. if you successfully unshake, you can act. Uh, if you spend a Benny, you can automatically unshake. Um, and then not have to worry about accidentally rolling a critical failure. I'm going to roll spirit because I'm a D10. So I feel, yeah. Uh, there you go. So an eight. So that's a success with a raise. Yes, you have unshaken. Great. Uh, I think I might take a step back uh, behind uh, <laughs> Alatar and then uh, I don't have this on this sheet, but on the sheet you sent me, I have force field. Uh, the defender surrounds uh, surrounded with a protective uh, energy that protects uh, all me and all others from harm. Each level spent is uh, one point of damage. So I and that's anyone within a medium blast. So I guess I'll grab all of us and I'll just give us all protection from one damage. Uh, if okay. All possible. So Do I have to roll spellcasting. There you go. Uh, yes. Let's roll spellcasting. I'm pretty good at plop, that plop, too. Plop, plop, plop. Okay. Yeah, that's a success. Uh, not with a raise though, but uh, um, yeah, that's a success. So this blue energy then surrounds. Uh, I think yeah. You watch Palando get like stand there as the white walks up to him, makes no attempt to defend him as it like just like slashes like does like a lot of damage that he he just watches and is almost fascinated by what happened and then goes huh don't want to have that happen again and there's <clears throat> and just like this this bright light of blue bright light emanates from him. very nice all right now in savage worlds when we end around we redraw initiative so uh you're all gonna have new action cards here there we go. And Alatar, you are first up with a queen of clubs. Incredible. Oh, <laughs> Fresh and ready to go. Um, let's see. We're in a cool little bubble. These three. Ah, I like the one in the front. And the last <clears> thing <throat> I did worked really well. Palando, can we just keep doing? Is there? I'm going to. And I'm going to bolt the one <laughs> in the front again. Great. Make that it so. Will. This one that down here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I mean, you can, but didn't you already do that? You want to do the same thing twice? <laughs> it w works. It's working. It's working. Listen, you use your free will how you want. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, an eight. An eight. Uh, that is a success with a raise. Amazing. So here's the thing. Um, it slaps when I do this, so I'm going to keep doing it. Um, that hits. Uh, you do hit the the white, and the bolt smashes up against it, but. It recovers, and it doesn't seem to have the effect that it did last time. I spoke too soon. You were <laughs> right. I don't like it here. Do you want to reroll your damage? Is a slice of life. Ooh. Yes. Yes, I do. Okay. So you'll need to spend a Benny to do that. Um, right. And uh, I don't know if you heard. So if you want to spend a Benny on your character sheet, you have the little tokens. Yep. There you go. All right, let's do this one more time. Oh, it was not better. <laughs> oh, <Meaningful>. oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, same, same dealy. Uh, it, it, yeah, it, nothing seems to have uh, happened when you when it, it gets hit with that bolt. This is bad, and I don't like it here. <laughs> <sighs> uh, speaking of that one that you were trying to is now going to come and attack you, Alatar. Wait, it can be inside the bubble? I don't like it here. It can totally- I don't want a body. The force field is just creating a minus one for them to hit you, basically. Yeah. Or is it a minus one for damage or a minus one for- It's a attack? minus one for- it reduces incoming damage by one point. Okay, so yeah, he, so he can totally still try and hit you, but it will be a minus one. Unforge. Uh, what is your, uh, that's, what is your toughness? Oh, goodness. Uh, I can read. Do you mean Perry? No, sorry, Perry, Perry, yep. Yeah, Perry. but Perry's four. Perry's four, so that's a five, so that does hit you, so let's see what your, da what the damage yeah. is here. Uh, that's a seven. What is your toughness? Toughness is a five. Okay, so that is a success. So you are now shaken. So go ahead and mark the shaken condition on your sheet. Um, <laughs> and, and what that means is that you cannot act on your turn unless you unshake. Copy. All right. Um, but you are not wounded, so you, you don't take damage at this time. Bundish. Yeah. Um, Bundish kind of yells over the clatter of, um, I guess bones, right? <laughs> we can kind of get kind of slapped around by bones. Um, she goes, I, I promise you that it's not always this awful. There are some amazing taverns up in the blue mountains and I'm just going to swing. I'm going to move around and swing at the, um, white head that just attacked Alatar. Um, Thank you. And let's hope I actually hit. My rolls have been terrible. It's going to be different now. Likes me. Everything's going to be different now. It's not. <laughs> I'm going to use a Benny. <laughs> yeah, I really do. I'm going to use all my Bennies at this point. Um, oh, God, it's going to be crit fail. I can feel it. No. It was exactly the same. Uh, I'm gonna, can I use one more Benny? I'm going to use this is my last Benny. I'm doing yeah. it. All right. You are out of Bennies. <laughs> Everyone, Drac Please is out of Benny's. <laughs> Please we help need me. A five, five dollar sustaining. Five dollar sustaining sub will give him one more Benny. Oh, oh, okay. twenty two. <laughs> twenty two. Holy crap. Um, okay. That's not bad. Uh, I, yeah, I, I um, need to. Uh, I, I need to see what this. Works. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I need to pull up my handy dandy raise calculator here. It's just one shot. Let's just be real. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Uh, so that's a success with two raises. So, uh, or sorry, I think there's more raises than that. But um, <laughs> I'd hope so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. So there is. There, Perry is a six. You got a twenty-two. 
That's a success with four raises. So give me a damage. They're going to take four wounds off of this. Okay. If you can do damage. Oh, yeah, or sorry, it's damage. not four wounds. It's just you, you, you hit really well. So you get an extra D6 on your roll. Oh, okay. An extra D6. Oh, in my next roll or my damage? No, this roll. This roll. Do your damage oh, okay. roll. That's a seven. So, uh, awesome hit, but it's a nine. It was a seven nine without deck shit. Oh, seven with an, with two nine. That's uh, yeah. You did some really cool work, but it did not um, seem to damage the creature. God, what are these things made of? And <laughs> I guess it's and, ready to try and, again. and you see that they they are all wearing this kind of bronzish breastplate, um, some some armor and stuff on them. It's super weathered and old, but there's clearly something um, to it uh, that's that's giving them a little extra boost. Yeah. Okay. Oh, does a, if it's a ten, would that change anything? So I have a plus one to damage. Would not. Dang it. Okay. Okay, uh, this white um, sees again that their friends have been getting attacked here and is going to move uh, here and is going to try to attack uh, Alatar again. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Mm, not, I bet the, they won't. not the heavily armored dwarf that has a huge axe. Yeah, I'm right here. <laughs> I've been swinging my my axe around. <laughs> you're you're ignoring all like, me. You're like done this like really cool spinning axe thing, and then just came down right in front of the the creature. Like it landed <laughs> in the ground, but it did not hit them. And the creature just looks at you, looks at the axe, looks back at you, and then if I can defend I, the white, this doesn't. The, the, <laughs> oh God. Uh, this doesn't usually happen. I, I I think just people watching. I think I haven't like performance anxiety. Um, <laughs> That's a six, six, which I believe is a success. That map it that beats your is. beats your parry. All right. <clears throat> Jesus. Unfortunate. Oh <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's a that's a ten. Um, your toughness is a six. Uh, suddenly uh, is a twelve. No. Oh. It's oh, it's a five. Yeah. <laughs> it's a five. Yeah, dog. So that's a success with a race. So you do take. You remain shaken, and you take one wound. Except oh, cool. you don't take one wound. <gasps> what? Oh. Because you're in my bubble. Oh. <gasps> nice. Orlando, and I just start crying <laughs> on my bestie. It's bad here. <laughs> oh, my bestie. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, so, Palando, you're up now. Thank oh, you. Yeah. Kill I'm them. Gonna, I'm going to go after that that thing that tried to hit my friend. Don't like that. So we'll we'll try this bolt thing that they seem so, so interested in. Yeah. Um, uh, so it's a three. <laughs> okay. That, that is not a success. No, I don't like it. I don't think it's good. <laughs> okay. Well, do you want to well, reroll? Uh, yeah, I'll, I will reroll since okay. I have rerolls to spend. I might Just have. try harder. Just do it again, but harder this time. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, <laughs> nope. No. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right. Hey, maybe you're right. Maybe bolt is the worst thing and none, none no. of us should do it. <laughs> nope. It sucks. It sucks. It sucks oh, real bad. You needed to use your staff of power. That's what it was. Blondo, the note is taken. We can move on. <laughs> Saruman. Shaking his head at the absolute struggle <laughs> that is Palando and Alan. <laughs> <laughs> all of them, honestly. Um, but so what, turn around. He, if you looked away, he, I'd be doing a lot better. Just like, well, I would say that he, he noticed that Bundash should have done a lot more than he did. Um, so he will give credit where credit is due, which end a lot. Um, but uh, at one, he just looks over at the white that's to his left, reminding him of the, reminding them of their duties, 
Um, and then looks at the one that just attacked uh, Alatar. Um, and he has his white robe, uh, like robes on, but suddenly it almost becomes um, like you start to see shifts of yellow and green and purple and blue and pink. Um, um, as he looks, and again, this voice echoes out as he says, Mimire. Um, and as I uh, say this word, these colors suddenly lash out as I'm going to activate my robe um, of, of scintillating colors. Um, and nice. I'm going to be putting a minor stun on that creature. I don't know if I need to roll anything for that, but. Uh, I, no, I think they just have to deal with, um, they have to try to, uh, avoid getting anything here. So let me see here. Your robe. Oh, thanks. It gives me the page number. That doesn't help me very much. Description. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right. I'm just going to have them roll a smarts to see if they are able to, uh, resist this. No. Yes. No. All right. Uh, so, um, uh, this one and this one both fit. Well, you're still mind controlling one, right? Oh, yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not trying to hit this one that's next to me. Obviously. Okay. So yeah. So they. So they. They're fine. So yes. Yeah, so you both. Of these two are are stunned. Great. Um, and as that as the robe returns back to its uh white sheen color, um. As a calculating individual, I have an action card of five or less. Um, and I'm going to uh, casually just beep, um, um, kind of spin my staff and multi action um, clock this thing uh, right in its temple. Um, which means because I'm calculating, I ignore up to two points of penalties. So I won't have to worry about a negative two for this. Okay. Okay. Uh, and I believe I believe that's uh, correct. I'm so not... your so your uh your attack. What's your what is your multi action? Uh, let me. Sorry. Uh, are you asking what I'm doing, or are you asking what what I have a certain thing associated with the multi action? No, just just what are you what are you because you you mentioned the multi action, but if you're yeah, only... so I so robe and attacking. Unless the robe is not an action. Oh yeah. So I would assume the robe is. Um. I'm going to say it probably is. Um, I'm going to say it probably is. I'm not as yeah. up to, with my. I, 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 I assume that active, uh, activating this robe would be an action. So yep. I, I was intending to do two things robe and then attack, which would be two different actions. Correct? Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So that's the minus uh, two, but you're calculating. So that. Uh, that, that I don't, yeah. Exactly. Yep. Yep. So yep. I roll uh, my. What? To hit it? Uh, fighting. I just want to check something real quick. Great. It's just flat out fighting. Got it. Why did I do this? Hell no. Well, it's not a crit um, fail. <laughs> I don't like the way you said that. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a Benny time. He's a better fighter yeah. than this. Did y'all see the Hobbit? Come on now. Hey, you've, uh, you, you have thousands of years to get to get to a point where you're right. You can... <laughs> I was born yesterday. <laughs> Let's try that again. Oh, there is no multi-action penalty. I just want to make sure that's noted. Da -da 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 -da. Boom. Hey, I heard you. Five? That's unfortunately not enough. Oh, no. We're all bad. It's I mean, like, this is the catalyst for Sauron to become a better melee fighter. Exactly. This really <laughs> is. And he kind of just like hits his staff and kind of grumbles to himself. Uh, but he <laughs> did what he needs to do. That's me. Nice. Nice. Okay. Glorfindel. Oh, 
once again, Glorfindel here to save the day. I exploded one of these ugly things' heads, and now let's explode the rest of these ugly things' bodies, shall we? Thank you, Saruman, for lining them up. I will knock them down. Uh, and I'm going to take out one, just a single arrow, string my bow, and point it at the sky. And then as I unleash it, we see that one arrow splits into multiple as I use like a scatter shot ability. And I'm going to try to have it rain down um, in like a large burst radius. Uh, can I spend a Benny for none of the arrows to hit my friends? Um, uh, you can actually spend, you should have power points. Um, Ooh, so you can spend, spend an extra power point to, to uh, per target that you don't want to hit. How many power points do I have? How do I see that? It should be. Um, it's in your powers. Oh, tab. I have 10. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. Uh, so I'll just, yeah. uh, am, am I, am I included in this? I don't think I am. Uh, so no. one, two, three, four. So I'll spend four. Cool. Yes. Okay. I'll spend four. Great. Okay. Um, then uh, four plus uh, you have to spend your power point to uh, cast the hail of arrows. Got it. Okay. So then I have spent five. I have five power points left. Okay. Uh, oh, ah! So uh, give me a, um, give me, a, you're going to cast this using your shooting ability. So uh, give yes. me a shooting roll. Let's do it. Nice. That's that's I think a I have nine. to do one for each. Uh, it's yes. Like separate attacks, I think. Yes. Okay. No, oh, we'll you're, you're damage, your damage is rolled okay. separately, okay. but your your attack is not. So uh, so that is a hit. So you are able to hit. Uh, let's let's see if we can move this template, actually, to get all of them in there. Um, oh, I don't want to hit the mind controlled one. Oh, OK, then perfect. Yeah, then so that's actually fine. Yeah. OK, great. Cool. Then I'm going to roll damage. That's a 3d6 plus one. Let's do Let's it. Let's go. I'm going to use a Benny. <laughs> I'm <Okay>. going to reroll that. <laughs> that was pretty bad. Not going to shunt. <laughs> Listen, Glorfindel You're... is such an arrogant little prick. So we'll see. Ooh, That's, but, I yeah. that. but it works and it's for a reason, apparently. <laughs> but you did get a six on one. So uh, that one actually exploded. So you should be able Oh, to... even on damage, it still explodes? Yes. Oh, my glades. I so so you guys. roll another roll in another d6 let's do it please make a bit six <laughs> oh. every time, oh, yeah, every, I think time. every time it did yeah it's i know so disrespectful. It, it does look like it actually calculated that um beforehand but um uh regardless oh sure uh 16 damage so that is uh enough and that one's dead and that one's dead as they yeah. just get impaled with uh, all these arrows just raining down from heaven. And surprisingly, maybe it's the force field. Maybe it's Glorfindel's just skill at this. Uh, who who will ever know uh, in the annals of time? But the arrows do not hit any of you. Um, yeah, I think they actually um, kind of cheekishly uh, go through almost go through your robes, but like they yeah. don't. Uh, one goes between your feet, uh, Bundush, and like one like on either side of the blue wizards and like they form like a semicircle around Saruman. It's like, yeah. he's fully just showing off now. Yes. Uh, and then he like sheets his longbow in like a single motion and sweeps that into a big bow. And the grand finale, my friends. Palando claps. Oh yeah. <laughs> Altar oh, has, it's like yeah. literally pinned to the ground by like three arrows. It's like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, ah, uh, yes. I, I, and you see Bonus like, still trying to tug his axe out of the ground, looking up at Glorfindel, like, I'm usually, I swear I'm usually better than this. I'm just off my A game. It's kind of, just give me a second. That's good. <clears throat> oh, it happens to everyone. It's a lot more common than people think. Very good, very good. Okay. Um, uh, so what do you want to do with this mind-controlled? Yeah, it's under my control. We don't gotta really worry about it. Uh... <laughs> right, but yeah. it was part of a thing trying to kill. Are we gonna keep it? Can we kill it? The first thing you need to know about these lands, Alatar, anything can be useful, even other people. Now, do I, I like it here? Is I have the ability to negate spells? Do I think I could? basically 
unmake the spirit, like whatever dark magic is keeping it tethered to the realm, can I just undo that? <laughs> Sorry, can you translate? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, uh, Palando, give me a, um, give me an occult roll. Oh, I'm quite good at that. Yeah, you've got a whole d4 in it. Um. Zero! <laughs> Straight up zero, because I'm very wounded. Yes. I'm very distracted. I'm I'm actually bleeding. I never I've never had blood <laughs> Wait, before. Is it does it stop at some point? It's it's I think it's blood. Um that would, oh, yeah, are terrible. That's blood. So, so don't like, how do you get it back in? Upon don't seeing I'm this. scooping it. Yeah. I'm like scooping his wounds. <laughs> So, my shirt is catching this, most of it. Well, this is this is a really long thing. I don't know what that is. Let me push that back in. <laughs> um, Glorfindel, you do see this, uh, and you have some healing ability. Um, I do. <laughs> you you know this, so oh. give me a healing roll. Rolando, yes. What are you doing? Please, my good friend, my boat comrade, and of course Alatar as well. But uh, oh, are we friends? Stay still. Oh. Oh. Alatar, I made a friend. Ah, I want a friend. Ooh, well, you can, can you be, be my friend as well, Alatar. Okay. And then Alatar like gets out of the way to let you do stuff. All right. <laughs> All right. This shouldn't hurt. If it does, just grin and bear it. And Glorfindel raises their hands up to your bleeding, like opened, bloody, gore-struck chest. And their hands begin to glow. Like, literally, like, angelic radiance explodes out of their pores. And they, boosh, like, lay it upon you. And I think no I need angel. to take a... Make a... Uh, I think I need to make a focus roll, I think. Focus on me. Focus, um, focus. Actually, uh, it probably says focus. Just give me a healing roll. Oh, sure. Um, How do I do that? <laughs> oh, is, uh, is... You should have healing oh, on healing your character smarts? sheet. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, cool. Let me do that. Okay. Uh, so that is a success. So you do heal one wound, um, Polando. Do you want to yeah. re-roll that to see if you can get more of his wounds taken care of? If I re-roll it and roll lower, do I heal none? Uh, no. You can, keep, you can keep whatever you rolled. That is a success. But unless you roll a critical failure. Oh, well, down. let's not speak that. Heal actually. him more, please. Thank you. This is not enough. He still has his you know, this is stuff coming out of him. If, if you roll a critical failure, it could go badly. That's fun. Oh, Elatar. You know what? Yes. Fine. Let history sing the praises of Glorfindel's magnificent God, death I and healing. Before, after this night. before you re-roll that, before you spend your Benny and re-roll that, other people... You can support Glorfindel in their role. Uh, you just tell me what you want, how you want to support. You make your role. If you succeed, you give them at least a plus one. If you get, if you roll with a raise, you can give them a plus two. You can give oh. up to plus four. Uh, can be added to Glorfindel's role with the success. Uh, yeah, I def Altar definitely is going to help. Just sort of being obnoxious over Glorfindel's shoulder and pointing out uh, all of the place places and the myriad ways in which uh, Palando is bleeding and damaged. Like, there's that <laughs> and that uh -huh. okay. and that there, too. You have to get all of that. Okay. okay. Well, thank on, you. We, on the boat ride, we became very, like, because we were new to bodies, I was just like, look, and it does this, and yeah. it's got this part. And then, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I have <laughs> a very important question to ask. <laughs> was it clear that Palando attempted to remove this creature while it's in my control. Uh, I would say you, he was too injured, but I think you, you probably sensed that he, he was just trying to reach out to like sort of end this thing's suffering or like send it back to wherever it's supposed to be. Like he does, it, he just got the sense that he didn't like that this thing is around and wanted to make it go away. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. Um, uh, and as he's looking at this creature, he'll just kind of look over at Palando 
Uh, then look at Glorfindel and he'll say, we are not like you. You need to treat us in a different way. Reach inside. That is the only way you will succeed. And I'm intentionally supporting to give this a negative four. Um, <laughs> well, your role is a negative four. Uh, my role is a negative four. Even better. Yeah. Even yeah. better. Yeah. Even better. Don't be trying to get rid of my stuff when I ain't done with it. <laughs> this is your first <laughs> lesson. Welp. Fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm sorry. I love it. That is great. Uh, the moment Bundish, like, I think Bundish, like, took a second to, like, pull his cape out from one of the arrows that kind of pick yeah. on, were pinned down. And then immediately, like, sees Polander, um, um, Palando bleeding out, sees, um, Glorfindel trying to heal, um, him, and sees Alata attempting to aid and just goes, uh, you all seem to have it sorted out. I'm gonna go digging. And it's just gonna go once he wants the barrow that he felt <laughs> the jewels and gems were. It's like, just, like, with his hand axe, he puts um, his great um, great axe back and pulls that hand axe and starts hacking at the ground, trying to get deeper in um, to where he knows the gems are being kept. Okay, so you're you're not doing anything with I'm the healing. I'm not helping at all. You're, I just was like, you're, uh, you're bleeding, you can figure it out. Uh, yeah. I'm going to get some riches. <laughs> okay, you can figure it out. <laughs> okay, Alatar, give me a common knowledge roll. Palando. Okay. Uh, give me a, uh, also give me a common knowledge roll. Uh, and then Glorfindel, give me your healing roll again. Oh, Am wait, I giving wait, anything? Not, not yet Glorfindel, actually. Um, yeah, Sauron, oh. um, uh, give me, uh, intimidation. <laughs> <laughs> but at a minus four. At a minus four. <laughs> of course. Two! <laughs> okay so you don't you don't support at all um it does not it does not nothing nothing happens palando uh, dang it i wanted to make it negative <laughs> 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 um palando that's a success with a raise so you give a plus two to glorfindel alatar that is a success so you give a plus one so you have a plus three on this roll glorfindel sounds good no and i have to spend a benny to re-roll it okay you, yes i'll spend a benny first and then a plus three total. Okay. Yep. Um, healing is going to be a. I'm just just let's just add a six to whatever. Uh, sorry, add a three to whatever this result is. Um, That's let's do it. Perfect. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. <gasps> okay. Okay. You know we don't even need to add a six. So um, yeah, that's that's enough. Damn. Uh, so that was Actually, a that a was a six. Yeah, that was a twenty. Uh, uh, which is a success with more raises than than wounds so yes palando the healing magic glorfindel comes over puts their hands over the wound and a soft glow uh and they kind of pull some roots up that are next to them kind of put them into the and immediately you start feeling better and things kind of start stitching up uh again and you just you just feel right as rain uh again Ah, look at that. I still got it. I've been asleep for over a thousand years, but this is still uh, still good. This is very not good for my ego. Though, <laughs> this is very dangerous for my ego. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Altar you. Altar just Thank keeps you. clapping. Or Altar. Like, yay! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank They're you. very good. Um, All right. You are very welcome. Oh, my God. Thank you. <laughs> so now um, we fast forward. Uh, a, a month or so has gone by as you oh, have Jesus. yes it's 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 quite a ways um, as you have traveled uh, across Middle Earth here I, I just want to ask really quickly mm -hmm. um, he would have asked the, the creature in their mind and they can telepathically uh, respond to them um, what they were guarding just so he knows oh okay um if even that. Oh, nah. <laughs> You asked, I shall return. The things that we guard are our bodies and the treasures beneath. But we act on Sauron's command alone. Mm. 
He will note that one. And he will, yeah. I think he'll just tell them to go away and stop existing, probably. Um, and <laughs> yeah, you know, keep continuing. Mood. Just right, for the humor of it. <laughs> just for the humor of it. When they say they, they treasure their bodies and the treasures, they. Keep. This was telepathic. Yeah, I know, I know. But like, just okay. like comedic timing. Bundish like, pops out of one of the burrows and just covered in like jewels <laughs> yeah. and necklace yes. they stole. <laughs> from, from <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> exactly, exactly.